this is this is probably going to be the quickest renovation I have ever done here on the channel, but I've been feeling so inspired lately by the basement treasures kit to completely renovate Kyle Kyleson's bedroom, which just so happens to be a basement. So what I did is I completely just gutted this entire space. I was feeling like this didn't look like a traditional basement. It kind of just felt like a bedroom that was underneath the surface. And so I wanted to fix that. I started by removing some of the lighting, creating kind of like a more dim atmosphere. And then I decided to swap out some of the exposed brick for the brand new wallpaper that's also a part of this pack and for the stair railing I got rid of that completely and that gave me a little extra in my budget like 200 simoleons or so and then I threw in this little support beam I really like the way that this looks and I decided to take those extra simoleons and create a little uh, like exposed closet which we will be using some of the new um, clutter objects to fill up later for lighting I'm using I think this is the this must be like the tool mod that allows you to do this I'm pretty sure that's what you guys said but I created um kind of a custom like I guess I don't even know what the heck to call it like a custom color for the light it's more of like a brownish shade I really like the way that that looks I am definitely going for a more spooky kind of like eerie vibe for this basement even though the home is super modern this basement looks like it has been here for freaking years there's also like mold spores in the closet that's probably got a smell but I love it I love all of the little like um wall decals and um, like details that come with this kit. I just, I've never felt so inspired to create a basement before or even play around with basements until this kit became a thing. And that's part of the reason why I wanted to share this renovation with you is because maybe you can take some of these tips and tricks and also implement them into your own basement. Also, um, I did use some debug objects from Strangerville. So the little, uh, what you might call it, the little um, fuse box that's over there on the wall. I plopped that in. I also threw in some exposed pipes. I didn't know what to do for this back wall exactly so I decided to use the retroplex tv console the broken one um, and I threw that down kind of like as a little like entertainment center and then I threw the square tube on top the fact that I'm able to like retain the names of these items just definitely speaks volumes for how much I love this freaking pack if you guys didn't check out my review or overview on the basement treasures kit I highly suggest that you check it out because I'm telling you guys this is definitely one of my favorites like there's just so many little small details like that lamp over there on the retroplex console actually like flickers and it gives off sound too which is so freaking cool like this kit creates a lot of ambience it's not just for looks uh this closet was giving me a freaking like it was giving me a charlie horse <laughs> in my hand i don't know why the items are being so like finicky but i was able to use um I was able to use some cheats to get the items exactly where I wanted them. So I have like a little box that has like a binder in it. It also has like some miscellaneous clothes. We have Kyle's infamous, <laughs> his infamous pink suitcase. That's literally like one of my first memories of him. And then we have the little uh, decor box too as well in there. I was going to play around with these like fairy lights, but I decided not to do that just because it wasn't in the budget and it didn't really make a lot of sense. I also gave Kyle a bike too because I envision... He's kind of an outdoorsy man. He probably likes to surf, swim, scuba dive, ride his bike every now and again. And I hate to say it, even though we love Kyle, he isn't the most cleanliest sim. So he does have like a couple, um, a couple like dirty socks and dirty drawers on the floor. I was going to give him this poster because if you've watched the earlier episodes where we met Kyle, he was super into those energy drinks, but I decided not to. I am playing around with CC too, by the way. So I definitely um, suggest checking out Shirley Sims because she has a functioning version of the Retroplex TV and these frames are also functional too so I can't wait to fill those up. Anyways I add in a couple other little miscellaneous items throughout the build but I'm pretty much done with the renovation. I hope you guys enjoyed this super duper quick video and if you did you know what to do. Don't forget to go ahead and comment rate and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below where the sun does not shine and I will see you all next time.